Hello, it's Scott Knife here, again from his security job, hence the lovely security hat we have in the background. Basically, I'm making this video to show some of the new products I'm carrying. Cold Steel just came out with their mace. It is called Cold Steel Inferno. It is supposed to be some pretty bad to the bone stuff. Two million Scoville heat units. Yeah, spray that on your finger and put it on the back of your neck. I'm not 100% sure about my pricing. It just came in. I have my price guide at the house. I'm at work right now. It comes in a big bottle. And it comes in a smaller bottle. Or it comes in the keychain bottle. Now, as far as knives go, I have the SRK. Bad to the bone knife. Just came in. I have the Cold Steel AK-47. The Cold Steel AK-47 G10, which is my personal favorite. I wish I could put the silver blade on the black handle. I have a Cold Steel Spike, which is glorified shank. It's the Tokyo Spike. Cold Steel Pocket Bushman, which seems to be a uh, broken design, um, according to Cutler Lover and nothing fancy. And they're good guys, and they know their stuff. But I personally am never going to put a knife through enough abuse to break it like that. Also, I have my mini tacks. I sold out of my Kiridashis. I have those on order. So I have two mini tack Skinners and one mini tack Beaver Tail left. Um, a lot of people have asked me about the out the fronts, okay? This is my only out the front. I just got it in. It's going for $60, okay? Let me open it up. I'm holding my camera with one hand. Thread. Comes with a nice little tactical leg mount, hip mount. There you go. It's like a Microtech clone. You got your grip tape. Spine action. There you go. Blade play. There's it's not really existent. You have to wiggle it pretty hard. It's very well made. Got your blood holes, blood groove. Um, as far as action on this one, instant. It's fast. Let me swap the camera to my right hand, being that I'm primarily right-handed. But this is one of the hardest launching knives I think I've ever had. It has a glass breaker on the back of it. 60 bucks again, free shipping, so if anyone wants this, hit me up real quick, it's my last one I have in, last one, okay, it comes with this sheath, so I'm going to set that to the side, now, I've had a lot of people asking me about the Spartan, it is coming, I've harassed Cold Steel, it is supposed to be on its way, so I'm pretty sure y'all have seen my Cold Steel AK-47s, okay, I am a very, very big fan of the Cold Steel AK-47 as I sit my camera down. Let's see here. First one is the G10 AK-47. I just figured I'd play show and tell for a few minutes. Let me show you all this one. Alright. First of all, it has a pocket snare, kind of like a wave, an Emerson wave. Great overall feel. Grivery percussion tip. Glass breaker, skull cracker, bottle opener, whatever you want to call it. Um, has something similar to the Axis lock on it, but it's not the Axis lock. And overall, I think it's a very nice knife. It's a little on the heavy side, but believe me, you can do some damage with it. The same version is right there, but it just has a metal handle. Nothing special. Um, Pocket Bushman, everyone talks about them. Tokyo Spike, I've talked about those, and all the mini tags. The SRK. Let me get it out of the box. It is a very popular knife also. Here we go. Comes in a secure X sheath. Let me sit my little camera down. I'm sorry I don't have my tripod with me. It's sitting on the butt end of it, but bring it out and look at that edge. Fine edge on there. SRK with a nice project some uh, molded handle. Feels great in the hand. Like any grip style you want to accumulate accumulate. You want to use, it accommodates it. Reverse grip. I mean, just the overall blade shape of this would make it mean going through whatever target or animal you'd like to clean or person or however you want to use it. Nice, thick, you could actually split wood with it. Um, overall, it's one of my favorite fixed blades Cold Steel's made besides the Taipan, which every time I get one it sells and I can't afford to get a lot of them. But overall, this is a very quick, very quick video. And here's a Cold Steel Inferno spray. 
I'm the first one to have it. it. Just came out, and I have 12 Spartans reserved. I've sold eight. So if you want a Spartan, hit me up. Check out my eBay store. And again, this is my small little cold steel. Oh yeah, and I have a mini pal also. But it's in the glove box. I sold it already. So, well, I guess that's about it. I really appreciate your views, and please subscribe. Believe me, I'm not just a cold steel person, but Lord, they make some solid stuff, and I'm an official cold steel dealer. So, that's how it goes. Thank you all so much. Have a great rest of the day, night. Well, it's about 3 in the morning where I am because I'm working my security job. I'm on break as usual. So i got to go back to my post. I really appreciate the views, and I guess I'll holler at you all next time. Thank you all. Have a nice night.